So this is our arm model with a lot of the muscles taken off. As you have noticed, there's both nerves and arteries on here that you will need to know. So we're gonna start at the bottom. Now, please note it's the bottom of the model, but this is the shoulder region. So right here, we have the brachial plexus, and there's an artery that it kind of wraps around. So this is your axillary artery. I'm gonna rotate this, and you'll notice there's a little branch right here coming off of the brachial plexus. That's going to be the axillary nerve. And we can follow that axillary nerve right here where it is around the surgical neck of the humerus. So that's the axillary nerve. This is the uh, humeral circumflex artery, the posterior humeral circumflex. What I often see people doing is wanting to call both of these axillary. Just note that they are not. Now, if we go back anteriorly, we also get another nerve coming off of the brachial plexus right here. This is the radial nerve. And I can follow the radial nerve posteriorly here. And this is a branch coming off of it. And we're gonna pick up that radial nerve right here. Notice there's a piece missing here. So these were muscles. This is the radial nerve. And we can follow it all the way up to the thumb. So the radial nerve is on the thumb side. Now I'm gonna go back to this view right here. So we had our axillary artery. Uh, other things that we can see here are going to be the brachial artery. So that's kind of what's hiding in here. We have an ulnar collateral artery right here. We have a radial collateral artery over here. Then here we get the anterior interosseous artery. Remember in anatomical position this palmar side is anterior. And then we also have over here the ulnar artery. Here's the radial artery continuing. Let me just, I think I called this radial collateral earlier. This is just the radial artery. And it's going up and they are both, the ulnar and the radial, going to contribute to this structure, which is the superficial palmar arch. And then there's digital arteries coming from that. So those are the primary arteries that you're going to need to know. Uh, we then get back into our nerves here. So, again, brachial plexus. We've already followed the radial nerve, so we've then got these two major branches. The one on this side is the ulnar nerve, and we can follow that up along the ulnar or pinky side and see it going up into the palm. If we go back down, we've then got this nerve. This is your median nerve. Please note it is median with an N, as in Nora, not an L, as in, I don't know, lemur, something with an L. <laughs> you make up your own memory trick there. So that's the median nerve, and we can follow that up right here. Now, if I flip it to the back, I just want to point out we also have the deep brachial artery right here. But those are the basic things that you need to know that are on that arm model.